The GovAI coalition started in the city of San Jose with a few key folks, Albert Kahami, Layla Doty, Khaled Tafik. Albert and Layla kept on getting inundated with all these vendors that were like, hey, we want to sell you this tool. It has AI. Hey, it it's going to be great. It's going to save you so much time. And like, while all that might be true, they didn't have a line of sight to what the AI tool was actually doing. They didn't really have a whole lot of leverage to say, okay, vendor, give us your secret sauce. Tell us what's going on behind the scenes. And they felt we're probably not the only folks in public sector that are going through the same struggle. I got involved actually in November of 2023. I was talking with a colleague and he was like, oh yeah, there's this like coalition of public sector employees trying to tackle AI and it's coming out of San Jose. And at that point in time, I'd already drafted a, a manual for AI use at DOR and a policy draft for AI at DOR. I sent them over an email and said, hey, I'd be really interested in joining and helping out. Here's what I have currently. Can this be of use? Can this be helpful? And the response I got back was, okay, so um, you're gonna lead our policy committees. Does that sound good? And so my colleague, Emily Royal, who's down in San Antonio, her and I led that policy committee. And in four months, which like still sounds crazy to think about, in four months, we took our team from not having anything really on paper to a fully fledged policy and a policy manual that anybody in the country can take, copy paste, add some bits and pieces to their existing policy or adopt ours and just insert city or state or government agency name. And now they have an AI policy.